One of the most tragic stories in the Old Testament is the story of Solomon's son, Rehoboam. Now, Rehoboam took over the kingdom, and his, his dad, Solomon, he, he set him up for success. And Rehoboam, when he began to reign, the, the, the leaders of Israel came to him and said, Hey, could you lighten the load a bit? And he went to the advice of the elders, and the elders gave him excellent advice. Then he went to, the, to, to get advice from his young friends, and his, and his young friends gave him the most stupid advice in the world, and it ruined everything. The, his young friend said, oh, you got to be Mr. Tough Guy, you know, tell him whatever. I mean, uh, you can read the story, it's in 1 Kings chapter 12. Um, and Rehoboam listened to his stupid friends. Now, the advice the elders gave him was this. They said, if you will be a servant to this people today and serve them and speak good words to them, then they will ser be your servants forever. The elders were saying, hey, be a servant to these people. Serve them. Speak good words to them and they will serve you forever. It's so important to speak good words to people. Rehoboam, am I getting his name right? There's, there, there was his, yeah, Rehoboam. Rehoboam, he didn't take this advice. And the kingdom fell apart. A tragedy, an awful story in the Old Testament. My brothers and sisters, if you have any role of leadership in your life, from a CEO of a company to a, a, a doctor who leads a team of, of, of nurses and, and uh, medical workers to, to parents who have children, you have to speak good words to them. You have to affirm them. You have to encourage them. Yes, sometimes you need to be firm and, 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 and challenge them and, and things like that. But the best advice I think I've ever heard on leadership is a, a leader who said, as a leader, you need to be a thank you machine. You need to be constantly thanking people for the good things they do, the way they serve, uh, the, the, the way they contribute. So brothers and sisters, don't be an idiot like Rehoboam. If you're in a role of leadership, don't, don't be mean to your people. Don't, don't be hard on your people. Be good to them. Speak good words to them and they will be your servants forever.